welcome to my home. My name is Kathy, and for Christmas this year, uh, my son blessed me with a green stock original five-tier planter. And so today, I'm going to bring you along while I unbox this and get it set up. So let's go. So I've opened the box, and I did take out a couple of things and look at them, um, but I'll show you what I got in here. And I don't know if this is standard that comes with it, because I, um, I looked on the website and it didn't seem to be. Um, so I don't know if he ordered it extra or if it was just a package deal that maybe he got at the time. Um, but in here I have six packets of seeds. There's some squash, tomato, it's a bush tomato, um, a tomato bush cherry, uh, sweet pepper, jalapeno peppers, and um, bean bush seeds. And in the packet that was in here um, that has the instructions, there's also a packet of sweet basil. So I put these to the side. And in this, it comes with, I guess it has the, the packet of sweet basil seed. There's also three cute little stickers in it. These are adorable. Um, there's a, a thank you card, and then the instructions. Um, the instructions appear to be very well laid out, exactly how to put it together. Um, and it also tells you how many um, of different plants you can plant per pocket. and just has different tips and things on how to grow in it, and how to water it, etc. So we're going to go ahead and get started and get this thing put together. So first, I'm going to pull out, he also bought me a, I think, I'm not sure if this, it's a base. So let's see what we got in here. Oh, more seeds. Oh my goodness. A bunch of more seeds. I should have opened this one earlier. Let's see what we got here. This is flower seed bundle. In the flower seed bundle, we have some lemon drop marigold, um, coleus, and stemon, and more marigold, some white marigold. Awesome. Okay, let's set these aside. And in this one, My dog needed to be in the video. Um, so we have some more jalapeno peppers, some more bush cherry tomatoes, some more bush tomatoes, uh, sweet peppers, squash. Looks like these are different squash and then the beans. Maybe these are different squash. Nope, they're the same one. So it's actually the same packet that came in the big box. So awesome. Got a jump start on my seeds for this year. And this is a, it's the base, and it's a mover, so we can, I'll put wheels on it, um, that way I can spin it around, and it's not the spinner, but I can move it, um, which is going to be great. So, put this down, and, and this, I have another packet of basil. Another thank you. And just some instru instructions it looks like. 
kind of for this. Okay, well let's go ahead and get this thing put together. Oh, that's cute. It's a little, if this, if this is a sticker or something. Um, it was packed with care by Tyler. So thank you, Tyler, for, for packaging this. wheels and the mover. I think these are pretty straightforward. Oh, they probably just pop into place. Yeah, they just push right down in place. Easy peasy. Assembly, use firm pressure to pop the wheels in place, alternating the locking and non-locking wheels. Oh, I did not do that. So, let's switch these two. Non-lock, lock, non-lock. Non you can tell if it's locking or non-locking because it has, the locking ones have a little, um, little thing that sticks out on them. For, for locking in place. So, this is enough. Those are on. Add the drain hose or cap if desired. Um, I'm not sure that I want to use a drain because I am in the house. So, I am going to use the I'm going to use the cap. All right, but it says plug hole to collect water. Do not leave in for longer than one week. Okay, well, I'm going to go ahead and do that because I am inside, so I don't want this draining all over the house. That. Okay, my base is in place. Let's lock the wheels. And just flip these up to lock them. Nope, put them down to lock them. Okay, well. It still move a little, but it does help it from moving too much. Okay. So next, I'm going to get this assembled. This is the top. I can see that it has the, the lines for where to fill it with water. So I'll set that aside. the same ones that I already have if they included. Yep. It appears that these are all the same the same beans, but gosh, now I have three packets of each type of seed. Fantastic. Okay. I think these are the little trays that go in between. The different stocks is there. Oh my goodness. Another packet of seeds. And this one, radish, beet, beets, 
turnip, and carrot. Awesome. Okay. Pull out. Has the tears. Pull these out. Get this box out of the way. And this box was also packaged by Tyler. Thanks again, Tyler. Okay. Now, does it matter what size, which way these go together? It does not appear to. Okay. So, it says, fill and plant. Fill each planter to the top with high quality potting mix and plant each pocket with starter plants or seeds. Stack gray, place gray discs on top of each tier, stack each tier, making sure the planter's feet interlock with the planter below. And then fill the top water reserve, reservoir until water comes out the bottom. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and fill this while this one's on here. And it says that these will each take one, um, one cubic foot of uh, potting mix. And it says to make sure you use potting mix and not like um, raised bed mix or um, like anything that you would use outside. So when I went to Walmart, I generally, don't get miracle grow, but that was the only thing they had um, for soil. I think it's because it's this time of year. Not pe many people are planting right now because we have um, freezing temperatures every night. It's getting down into the teens um, or low twenties, and um, during the day, you know, some days we're lucky we'll to even get out of the thirties. So um, it's not outside growing season so that's why I'm setting this up inside because I'd really like to grow some lettuces and um, some veggies inside because I can't do anything outside of my garden so um, I'll go ahead and start getting these filled and stacked. really hard. Uh, it says not to do that. But you don't want to just, you know, because if you push too hard on these, it can like push them out. So I'm just gently pushing the soil into place. This each will take one one bag of soil. Before I go too far, I'm going to take this off and make and get the soil out of there. There we go. Okay. 
All right, I think that's it. So I'll go ahead and just keep filling and stacking. Is that dirt good, Stella? <laughs> down here and show you what I'm doing. As you can see, the little feet go on either side. So the feet will go on either side of these here to lock each to lock lock each tier into place. Okay. Now for the next one. Okay, so there's the last tier, and now for the top. tears on here. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and water this um, just so I can see how the whole system works. Come summertime, I'll most likely, or springtime, I'll most likely move this outside onto the deck um, outside my kitchen. So I'll have easy access to it because i um, not sure exactly what I'm going to plant in here yet. Um, but I think I'm going to start with a bunch of these little starts, uh, seeds that they gave me and uh, go from there. So here we go. Okay, I can feel it in this one. I can feel it coming out in that one. It's not coming out in this one yet. Nor that one. These top tiers are getting wet. The top three so far are getting wet. The bottom two, not yet. Um, so that was two gallons of water. Like I said, since I'm going to be doing seeds, I think I'll, that'll be enough for now. Um, because um, I'll just primarily be just misting the top of the soil until my seeds sprout. Um, and then I'll, I'll uh, that's how I'll, I'll water, is I'll fill this top um, however often it needs it. Yeah. 
Thanks for coming along with me while I unboxed and set up my new green stock. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're not already subscribed to my channel, please consider subscribing and be sure to hit that bell icon to be notified each time I put out a new video. Well, until next time, I hope you have an amazing day and we'll see you on the next video. Bye now.